he's got a pair, isn't it? Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of CJ Explores. Today we are in Xi'an, which used to be the capital city of China. Now we're going to show you around the top things to do. First of all is the wall that surrounds the old city. is just around the corner from our first destination here in Xi'an and it's this wall here it's the best preserved ancient wall of all of China and it's also known as the fortifications of Xi'an We are in the old capital city of China and we're about to go up the wall. Now we're at the south gate which is the uh, the most decorated gate. So we got our tickets of 54 RMB each. We have a little map, I'm not sure how much we're going to discover. I think it's around 8 miles long, the whole circumference, but we'll go and have a look. Ancient times they didn't have the technology to go through a wall. So that's why the main defences were at these gates and they had four of them north, south, east and west. So there's a lot of lanterns and decorations. I'm not sure exactly, it might be because it's the 2020 New Year in a few days, I'm presuming. But it says that um, this memorial is derived from some information about the Silk Road, because the Xi'an city is really closely linked with the Silk Road. They believe that Muslim Quarter, it's like a big, it used to be the original trading area. And we're gonna go check that out one evening, so. We'll see what else there is to see. Okay, so just as you enter the south gate, there is a little cafe down in the first little courtyard section, but it was super expensive. When you get up on top of the wall, take a left, and there's a little cafe here, city cafe, and it's like half price. 20 RM for an espresso versus 40 RM for an espresso downstairs. You can rent bikes up here, and you can do the whole circuit around Xi'an's inner city. Um, the prices are... You can also do a tour car, so they take you around in like a little shuttle, like an open like golf buggy. So that's one way to see the wall, but um, we're just going to do a small section of it today. Um, just take a little walk along and back. Oh my god, there is a KFC up here. I think it's because of the Chinese New Year celebrations that they've got a few more like pop-up stores along this section, um, as well as all the decorations. It looks cool, but that's not right, is it? So this wall stands at 12 meters tall all the way around and it's the largest ancient military fortification in the world. Now along the wall at Xi'an you'll find ramparts spaced evenly along the wall and they were spaced at a distance which archers could reach the middle between those two ramparts so that they could attack any enemies who were trying to get over the wall. So being on top of the wall, up here we've noticed a lot of the um, houses next to us have rooftop areas. We've noticed it on our hotel too, we have a rooftop like bar and cafe. So it definitely seems like it's something you should look at when you're trying to find your accommodation. So I think, especially in days like this, it's going to be so nice to sit on top overlooking the city and watching the sunset.
Last day here in Cien. Last day in Cien. And I don't want to be outside. <laughs> Why not? Because we have a cold already and now people are dying from colds. So yes, there's been a virus outbreak in China and we're not really sure how bad it is. We've actually been sick since uh, Harbin, but I think that's because we were freezing cold. So not sure. We'll see how it plays out. I don't think it's that bad. The couple of people that have died already are, well, they had Ill, they had some sort of like health complications already. So I think it's just a a thing. Like if you're poorly and you get more poorly, you're at risk, I guess. In the hustle and bustle of the Muslim quarter here in Xi'an and legend has it that this is the start of the Silk Road. Uh, you can really see a heavy Muslim influence here and it's fairly chaotic, loads going on. Um, not sure what's okay to eat or not, we'll figure it out. Amazing. Come on, come on, come on. 